But when we, we talk about physical activity, we immediately think of, does it help your physical fitness? Does it help you avoid things like heart disease and getting fat and so on? Uh, but it's fairly obvious now that it really has a major role to play in helping us with mental health as well as physical health. And the way it does that is, first of all, it can help prevent mental illness. Uh, I mean, issues such as depression, dementia, which is increasingly a problem with older people. Um, uh, Alzheimer's disease and so on but also it can help us treat those problems so part of therapy so if we get people who are active many people benefit from the added activity and it helps them overcome issues such as depression and anxiety and so on uh, but also I mean physical activity can help us feel just generally better I mean we might talk about that as being mental well-being so it makes us feel good about ourselves so we're happier with our bodies we feel we're doing something positive with our lives and um, it's it's actually part of quality of life so those three things are really important the avoidance of mental illness so physical activity helps us reduce the risk of mental illness it also helps us maintain good cognitive function, good thinking ability, especially as we get, get older, uh, when it's very easy to let that slip away and our memory goes and so on. Uh, but also help us with quality of life and experiencing happy, healthy lives. So that's the way it really helps. And what do we de need to do? Well, it, it really can be anything that helps us make feel feel better so going for a walk at lunch times can contribute if it makes you feel good but generally speaking if we do aerobic activity activity that gets you out of breath makes you work a little bit harder the evidence is greatest for that kind of activity to really do the most for our mental health